as you guys know, this has been something I wanted to do. But by this point, there's just no excuse now. Three years late, but I don't care. My priority is to make sure that I get a lot of this up. So, let's get started. This is the grandfather of JRPGs. The thing that started it all. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the first Dragon Quest. Why, were you expecting anything else? Yeah, because it is actually based off the mobile version. Which in and of itself upsets me. I make it at NJ. This is a playthrough of Dragon Quest because I promised I would do this. Besides, I'm a fan of RPGs and you guys already know that. I want you all to know that because if you've seen my channel, I've done many RPGs on it, such as Kingdom Hearts and Pokemon. But to not do this, that's an insult in and of itself. And yes, I will be returning back to Dragon Quest XI again. But I want to start doing the first three. And if I get a three, new 3DS XL with a capture board, I will most likely be doing the other Dragon Quest games as well. Because there is so much to do and not a lot of time. Hey, I'm making sure you guys enjoy what I can. After all, I love doing this. I love RPGs. It's a passion I love. And it's a shame it's not doing well in terms of viewership. Which I will hopefully be explaining as we progress. So yeah, it's time we finally get this started. Let us begin the original Dragon Quest. Yeah, not much on the matter. When you begin, you create a new adventure log, and you make your name. But for the purposes of this, I will be referred to as Destiny. Who else would it be? It works for me. Sadly, this is the only party member you get. Destiny, scion of the bloodline of Erdrick, hero of legend. Long have I awaited thy coming. In days of yore, thy revered ancestor did receive of the almighty goddess the Sphere of Light. By its power was our world rid of the menace which did beset it. Yet alas, some few years past, there did arise a new threat, the Dragon Lord. With his cunning, he did steal away the Sphere of Light from us, plunging the land into darkness once more. Should this state of affairs be suffered to continue, the night must surely take unrelenting hold in our realm perish. So I say unto thee, destiny of the bloodline of heroes, vanquish the accursed dragon lord and reclaim the sphere of light. In the chest over yonder wilt thou find items to aid thee on thy quest. Take what thou wilt with my blessing. Partake thee also of the wisdom of these loyal subjects gathered here in my throne room. Doubt not, but that their knowledge will serve thee as well as any shield. May the Guidus guide thee to victory, and return thee unto us ere long, brave destiny. This is basically it in a nutshell. And a magic key. How nice. Not much on the matter, you start off at level 1. You have no equipment either. Well, I guess we'll have to get started since we don't have much. Yeah, you also have no all have 120 gold. So you have to make do with what you got. Huh. 
Ah, <sighs> yeah, this is basically it in a nutshell. Dragon Quest how it should be. Believe me, this game is archaic nowadays. But back then when it came out in 1986, it was revolutionary for its time. And yeah, you only have one party member, the hero you're playing. You gotta battle in order to get stronger. And if you want to survive, this is the only way how. And these are the slimes, the most recognizable mascot in Dragon Quest. They're basically the mascots. And it bothered, bothers me that they could have just made like an entirely like new version of this game. But no, they had to take it from the mobile game because Square Enix was just bloody lazy. Of course they've been lazy. Been like this for a long time. Why would they bother making a brand new game when they could just do this? And one of the reasons why I wanted to do this is pretty simple. It's because it's been too... I just simply want, wanted to get this done. And I know it's dumb, but hey, I tried. Nice, we're level two. But we still have a long way to go. But at least we can take the opportunity to get better gear. Yeah, we need to get the copper sword. But at least we can get our hands on a leather suit. That's that. Yeah, you're gonna have to take advantage of getting, of resting up, stocking up, and battling. This is the only way. And expect to grind, because that's what you're going to do. This is your world map, the Kingdom of Alephgard. Not much, but you're gonna have to work your butt off if you want to make sure you get through with it. I played this on the 3D on my 2DS 2DS XL that I modded, and let me tell you, it always baffles me why they didn't decide to bring it over. And then I remember that Dragon Quest was was brought to the end was brought west side in 1989 as Dragon Warrior, and now Nintendo completely bungled the whole thing. Expecting and selling a million copies, hoping it would be a success, and it didn't. And because they were stuck with excess stock, they basically gave it away as part of every new subscription. And that in turn basically gave Nintendo that stern look, or rather Nintendo giving Enix the stern look. Enix lost the support of Nintendo of America after that, so Enix took it upon themselves to release the others. Which I swear, they always bungle every time. Still got a ways to go to get that armor. Yeah, this is basically it. All battles take place one-on-one. -on -one. And I spend time with this game every chance I could. Well, that wasn't so hard. We have no choice but to head to the cave northeast. Right here. This is the cave in question. But it seems new enemies decide to get on our nerves. Well, that wasn't so difficult. find our way around. There are no enemies here, thankfully.
This must be it. The stone tablet. I am Erdrick. Hear me well, bearer of my blood, heir to my destiny. If you would reach the evil island visible from Tandagel's shores, you will require the three sacred artifacts. Gather them, and you may yet cross to that accursed isle and destroy the source of all evil, as I did, too did so long ago. Before my passing, I entrusted the three objects to three great sages. If the fates have been kind, their descendants guard them still. When evil rules the ill-starred isle once more, gather the hallowed triad and strike a blow for the cause of light. No doubt, those of the line of the sages await you somewhere in this world. Seek them out. Blood of my blood, child of my children, go forth and fulfill your destiny. Never an easy thing, is it? Made it out of there, so now we know what we have to do. Well, that means we gotta grind a little further. Yes, this is how it has to be, unfortunately. You wanna get stronger? This is the only way how. Time to go on the offensive. Nice, we reached level 3. He also learns the heal spell, which is going to be very useful, mind you. And by the way, there is an easier way to do this instead of heading to the end. You talk to this guy here. When dark doth spread across the land, light shall return my Erdrick's hand. There, like that, see, you gain all your MP. It's that simple. You just stop at the guy again and you heal, no problem, buddy. But heal were like 3 H, 3 MP. Yeah, Dragon Quest implements an HP and M MP system. And you'll have to take advantage of using items. Oh yeah. I guess we do have enough to get the armor. Or wrap. It's actually... We got the soup, but we need the shield. Now we gotta save up to get a copper sword. Yeah, that's basically a nutshell on how, how RPGs work. This is the grandfather. Fight. And sometimes if you're lucky you get crits. I know this because I ever sent because Hero was my main and Smash Ultimate. And I was able to get him to Elite Smash after a lot of work. Now they gotta bring out the bats, the Drakis. They're not that tough either. Now we gotta grind up to where at least level four. Warm up. How nice. On going. There's the next town, the Kingdom of Garenhead. Just a bit more, we might get a better weapon. Because a bamboo stick isn't gonna cut it!
And yes, grinding is an essential component for this game. Yeah, if you want to survive, this is the only way how. Some people may not like this because it makes the game slower, but here's the thing. This was the first RPG of its time. When it first was released in 1986, it wasn't that well received, and all it took was a Shonen, was Shonen Jump to at least tell people what the game's about, and things just ballooned almost immediately. That's basically that. And we reach level four. And also gains the Sis spell, which in the original NES version is known as the Hurt spell. Believe me. It's been gnawing at me for some time, and I I've been watching a YouTuber that has gotten, like, guides for the entire Dragon Quest series. Even Dragon Quest X. Hold on, let me at least... There you go. Alright. Now let's head to the shop and get ourselves a new weapon. They even added an item shop, though, so that's nice. Yeah, but they even added this. Which means you gotta have to grind your butt off in order for you to get better gear. Fine, I'll have to make do for the time being. You only have a limited amount of items, so you better make sure you do what you got. Now you gotta head down south. Oh yeah, you gotta head northeast. Which means you're gonna have to grind. Enemies go down at the drop of a hat. Yes, you're going to have to grind. Oh, sorry. That was a mess up on my part. Plus, I need... The, and plus, this stuff is going to get more and more expensive, so you're going to have to grind. And you want to know the worst part? You have to make sure to return back to, to Kingdom of Tanagel to save your progress. Bought off to get it. Yes, I'm still re-downloading stuff because I still haven't finished it up yet. And it takes a lot longer than it should. Which is why I also need to get a better Ethernet cable. Yep, it's gonna take a long while. I'd rather wait till I reach level 7. But you don't want to get too reckless. Because of enemies like this. There you go. And 
I gonna die? Yes, I am. That's not a fun way for you to go, dude. But what is this brave destiny? Defeat Dalu become me? That thy reckless vexeth me I shall not deny, but there is naught for it. Thou must be set upon thy path anew. Yet swear to me when the next thou suffereth, thou wilt straight away to the nearest town and there scattered in. I pray most fiercely that thou wilt not require such aid again me in the future. And you might want to save your progress. That wasn't what I wanted to do. Seriously, that was the dumbest thing. Yeah, and you want to know the worst part? You die, you lose half your money. So you better be careful or else you're pretty much bummed. Let's hope we don't do that again. Now we gotta head up north. No, that means we gotta go around because the mountains ain't gonna cut it. Much better. The enemies ain't gonna make this any easier. Should be able to make it though. Now we reach level five. Not bad. At least we made it, that's for sure. What's this? The fairy flute. We'll hold on to that. Hast thou set foot upon the Isle of the South of this place? Tis fame for the town of Rimmeldaw would stand proudly upon it. Well, let's hope this can actually help us out. Yeah, because our next stop is at the rain shrine. But I want to grind a bit. Out of my way, buddy. Thank you. Yes, because in order for me to get stronger, this is the only way how. As you get stronger, so do the enemies. Thou art destiny, art thou not? Word of thy quest to defeat the Dragon Lord hath reached even unto this far flung place. Alas, thy foe is blessed with strength beyond reckoning, and I cannot suffer thee to go to thy certain doom. 
Therefore thou must first be tested. Somewhere in this world there is a harp onto which Melody the beasts of the wild do flock as moths to a flame. Bring me this curious instrument, and the staff of rain shall be thine. The shiny harp. Level 5 and we're not wasting time. I'd rather keep going to- i rather grind up till I reach level 8. Yes, like I mentioned already. It gets repetitive? But this is an art. But this is the granddaddy of all RPGs. This brought the mod, the, the console style RPG, the JRPG. A shame that JRPGs are not given that much appreciation, which I hate with a bloody passion. Oh, you dare attack me? That's not nice. Now you die. No, because I gotta grind up and garen him. Yeah, if you want to survive, you have to grind. It's stupid, I know, but at the end of the day, you have to. Heck, I played this game on the 3DS in Japanese. I didn't understand it, but I are, and I knew what was to expect in this. Yeah, pressing the X button gives you the map. And this map of Dragon Quest 1, it, it may be big, but let's just say that as the later games progress, they get much bigger. I only wish that Square Enix would have given us the other Dragon Quest games on modern consoles, because four games, five counting Dragon Quest treasures, aren't gonna cut it. This franchise needs more exposure. More exposure, more opportunity, and more people to play and experience this. Because it's a damn shame that not many not many see this through. I swear. Oh wait, what am I doing? Oh yeah, you check your items right here. This is the fairy flute. And you're gonna need this for later. Very good. That's gonna be needed for much later. Yeah, I need the chainmail and the iron axe if I'm gonna survive a game like this. Fifteen HP, that's how much it's got. And that suit is gonna hurt. Also, herbs are helpful in case MP ain't gonna cut it. So far at 192 gold. Just gotta keep it going. Chainmail is roughly around 300 gold, and then you have to grind to get 560. And some of the tougher enemies won't give it to you that easily. They won't give it to you that easily. How about you burn?
Get in the hang of it now, aren't we? Oh, you dare sizz me? Shame on you. Nice. Now we reach level six. Just a bit further and we should have more than enough money. And besides, having, having more armor can actually help. This is getting dumb. Very good. Let's get ourselves rested up first. At least we pay six coins and we get the other armor. Alright, let's get the chain mail. Then you're gonna grind up to get the iron axe. Leather suit we sell for 35. Yeah, buy what you need, sell what you don't need. I wonder what is the maximum you can hold. Good they made it like multiple, so that way it'd be easier. I gotta grind some more so I can at least get more money. At least they get a copper sword at least, because I'd rather not want to risk the chance. Because we need to head to the Rocky Cave next. That's worth it. Because this thing basically like yeah has heavy armor, so you know what won't work, just burn it. I forgot, I'm I'm a dummy. Again, why must I waste my time with this dribble? Dare you.
Well, if the right enemies show up, I could get more money faster this way. Hell, Dragon Quest 1 is on everyone, mobile, on the Switch. I swear, they should have added it more. It was on PS4 and 3DS, but only in Japan. Why Square Enix decided not to bring it over, I will never know. What, it's gonna get blasted because it looks like a mobile ver- like a mobile- like, like him for a phone? Square Enix baffles me sometimes. They baffle me in more ways than one, and I- and I truthfully hate that. I truthfully hate that Square Enix don't put the effort when it comes to their games. They like to take the predatory way, and it has to stop. I missed. Thank you. And plus, having an iron axe would actually make it easy. Big as a club ain't gonna cut it. Eh, not much we can do. Will this mean you finally go down? Not really. Nice. Still at this. Really gotta fight this thing now? Good, now burn. Still at it. Yeah, like I said. This, I put a lot of information on the description detailing about its history and everything. I wanna do this because I should have honestly done that sooner. Don't say. I already have 300 and I need to get enough to get an axe. Gotta get stronger. Very good. We got 17 MP. That might do us good. Once we get the axe, then that's it. I don't have to worry. Seriously, how can I make this fun to watch? Because it's be boring. And that's the thing. I could go on and on rambling for like hours on end. It wouldn't be right. It just wouldn't be period. Hold on, let me make this burn. There you go. Nice, we reached level 7. Nice, I can put them to bed for a bit. That's more like it. Still got a ways to go with this.
But later on, you'll have to grind and get better armor, better gear, so you'll have a chance of surviving again in the end of the game. The game isn't long, though. It's just that this game can be quite tedious. Nowadays, people would bash this game over how archaic it is. Just like how it was back in 1989 where they bashed it because people would rather play Mario, Castlevania, or Mega Man and not a game like this. As someone who plays video games all their life, that makes me sad. It makes me sad that you wouldn't get, give, give this a chance. But I guess that's what Western gamers wanted back then. I'm thankful I own almost all the Dragon Quest games, except for one, Dragon Quest X. And Square Enix won't bother bringing it over, because why would they? They wouldn't make it a good business move if they can't exploit it for monetary gain. Just still going. All I want is an axe so I can start whacking people. Finally, get to knock your face in, you dang Dracolite. They're basically red Drackies. Yeah, around here in the mountain is your best bet. And this is gonna get real repetitive, real fast. As if it already is. But I decided, but like I meant, oh wait, I'm being repetitive again. I hate that. I should be working on Final Fantasy 2, not this. But I chose to do this. Well, that was easy. Just a bit more. Then I can not only heal myself, but also I can be able to get a better gear. Oh, nice. Get a free hit. That's the pre that predates preemptive strikes. If the enemy doesn't notice you, you get a free turn. Very good. Hello, prepare to get wrecked. That's how it should be. Now let's get the axe. This, the Iron Axe. All that grinding, it better be worth it. Yeah, I know. How about you sell how about you sell this? At least now I can be able to do this. I'm at level seven now. All that grinding and look what that got me. Fortunately, I have more than enough to tackle the rocky the, the rocky cave. And that's south of here. Now let's see the results come to fruition. Here, eat this. 
There you go. Hello, Dracolite. Get ready to get wrecked. Let me check my map. far from here. Yeah, you're right. Without the torches, I can't even see. Let's fix that. Besides, it won't take us that long. Oh dear, a skeleton, but it does not notice us. Yeah, you're dead. Goodbye. But, man, it gives you a lot. Ah, let me make sure you burn. Maybe I can use the opportunity to get more more stuff. Don't worry, it ends once we once we're done with the rocky cave. Come on, you want to get in my nape way now? Come on, this is dumb. That's better. Just wait till we do Dragon Quest 2 and 3. Especially 3. Well, at least we made good progress with our gear. Let's find out how many we, what's the maximum we can have. Yeah, you have to buy this one at a time. It's a front of its time, but by now they should have changed that. Final Fantasy did that. Why not this? Oh, the maximum you can carry is six. Okay then. This is still absolutely dumb. Yes, I'm gonna nitpick this, don't get me wrong. Oh, he can't carry anymore, huh? I see. Fine, we'll just buy the dragon scale. Wait, what? Let me see this. Wait, they made Torch a separate item? And you can only carry as much as he can let you. But yet they make medicinal herbs like... Are you serious? No wonder is this archaic. And there's no bag either. Fine, let's just get this over with. It is so dumb, it's just not funny. Not far from here. Now die! Okay, now let's do this. You gotta go up and around. And you gotta deal with the lunatics. 
Yeah, it's dark to say the least. At this point, they're not so difficult now. You gotta go all the way down here. Nice, we get more money. That's pretty good. If we're lucky, we might get enough to get the Iron Shield. Yep, that's a dead end. That means we gotta go up and around. Oh, nice. I can hold my own against these things. Goodbye. That was good. Oh, look, a skeleton. How are we going to deal with you this time? Okay, that hurt. Stop that. More money for me. More money? Do I have enough? Oh, no, a fight geist. And you're not that tough. Good riddance. We reach level eight. Another torch. A Dracula. Oh, you like to heal yourself, huh? Stop healing and start dying. Good riddance to that. A Ledgerman? Okay, that crit was a bit unnecessary. But okay, I guess. Why would I need to buy an iron shield when I can get that for free? Good. Now you don't need this. Yeah, look at your status now. Your defense is... Your defense is now up to 30. Oh, goody. You're back for seconds. Stop. Seriously. You're making me waste my herbs. Although, on the other hand, these guys really do give you a lot of money when you beat them. Again, you'd never learn! Take that! Goody, a seed of strength. We only raised by one. And a seed of magic. Nice, boost our MP. Why 
Why did you miss? Thank you. A warrior's ring. Known as a one by a warrior who fought at Eric's side. Eric's side. I see. Time to get out of here. We've done all we set out to do. Can you, like, stop? Thank you. Really, is the encounter rate this high for a game like this? It better not be. Oh, that's not good. Good, I'm at 43 HP. These fools never learn. I see. That leads to an exit. Then we'll have to take a long way then. Fine by us. And they never learn. They never learn, do they? That's the end of that situation. Oh, here we go. Well, that was easy. That's done. Now that we got that finished, we can now have the marshy pay. And plus, we already got the iron shield, so we have no need for it. Although, on the other hand... I want to save up for the steel armor. I honestly want to save up for that. So hopefully, I can be able to survive. Yeah, once you're strong enough, nothing can stop you. That's the whole point of what Dragon Quest is. You have to battle in order to get stronger. It's basically like real life. You have to train and make yourself stronger. You want to live a better life? That's the best way how. Yeah, we're getting close. Well, we at least made it back. Yes, you have to return back here in order to save your progress. Let's save our progress, yada, yada, yada. 
Yes, I want to save. Because I'm not going to go through all that garbage. I am done with this. That is it for part one of this. I will pretty much see you in part two. If you enjoyed this, like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell. I know not many people will like it, but honestly, it don't matter. I love Dragon Quest, and I want more people to know that. So yeah, that's it. This is Mayhem and Andrew signing off. Peace out.